morning guys so we're uh, in our room we're all packed up we are headed to Agra today uh, but we're gonna stop over in this village in northern Rajasthan and uh, go to the step well there Chambora which I'm sure I'm grossly mispronouncing but yeah we just had breakfast uh, I had a cup of masala tea which is so good it's really just tea and milk but it's so good we got up super early this morning. Our tour group actually isn't leaving until um, 8.30, but Zach's suit was delivered at 5.30 this, well, it was supposed to be delivered at six. Um, oh, sorry, my hair is just not making me happy. Oh, excuse me. Be right back. Our doorbell rang. Sorry about that. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Let's, let's focus this baby. That poor guy said words to me and I didn't know. I don't know what he wanted or what he he needed. Um, anyway, so we're headed to Northern Rajasthan today. We're gonna go to Agra, but we're gonna stop at the step well. On our way there, Zach's suit was delivered, y'all. It was. So handsome, he's so handsome. He's never had a custom fit suit before because, I mean, we're bougie, but we're not like wealthy <laughs> bougie. We're like poor people bougie. <laughs> All right, we'll do an outfit of the day. Let me turn some lights on here. I turned the lights off to try to like improve our lighting. Didn't really work. So, let's see. Let's see if I can get this to focus. I am wearing this dress today. I love the length of this dress because it makes me feel long and feminine, but it's not so long that it'll actually get in the mud and the dirt. The only thing I'm worried about is the top. Like, I don't know if you can see, it almost looks like I have cleavage, which is probably not cool in India. So, I will probably like wear a shawl or something, but we're gonna be on the bus for the most of the day, so not too worried. Uh, I know you guys are super excited to see Zach's uniform. What? What? Look at this. I have pants and a shirt. Yes, he does. Pants and a shirt. Did you wear that shirt yesterday? Yeah. Oh. He wore a blue shirt yesterday, so. No more black shirt yesterday. Remember? It black oh. on black. Yeah, he had black on black. Um, oh, we should have taken a picture of him yesterday, because these are his regular hiking pants, and we actually got him some other, other less obvious hiking pants. I know. You guys are super into his hiking pants. But he's just, we're just going to chill out. We um, didn't get everything charged last night. This is what Zach has been watching. Let's see if I can get it to focus in. I've been calling it Tackle Box this whole trip. I don't actually know what it is. What actually is it, honey? I'm trying to, it is Kabidi. Yeah, Zach has been watching Kabidi nonstop. It's the greatest sport ever. It's a combination of tag and tackling. Yeah, he's been watching it nonstop since we got to India, so. <clears throat> Turns out, even if you don't have UK basketball to watch, your husband will find some sport to watch. In this case, tackle box. All right, we'll see you guys when we get to the step well. group is all stretching. We thought we were going to stop here and get some beer, but we essentially pulled the equivalent of showing up to a restaurant on Christmas. It's Diwali, so the brewery is closed. So instead, our, our group is all stretching and it is super fun. Our tour group this time is really awesome. Man, baby, you really messed up.
stop for a bathroom break and this place is super cool. It's like an old palace. We're just gonna take a stroll around the gardens after peeing. Plus I had like Western style toilets, which is a bonus. Let's see if we can show you guys. Beautiful garden. Isn't this lovely, honey? It is. Just... India has the most random, beautiful spots. Just this fountain. Just love it. Some gardening. over here. Pretty, pretty. <laughs> Just walk. Just walk like normal, you dork. What? So you just walk like normal, you dork. No, I will march. I'm like peeping in at these people's pool. Oh my gosh. Apparently this is like a hotel. I would not mind staying at this hotel. So pretty. It's like the patio. Oh my gosh. It's the palace over there.
So we're at the step well and it's incredible. It's really Pretty beautiful. Amazing. Yeah. I don't know if the photos can do it or the video can even do justice towards how great that it is. Um, it's also probably the most rural part of India we've been in so far. So, covered up a little bit with a shawl. But, I mean, just like so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. This was one of the sites I was most excited about, and it very much lived up to what I dreamed it could be. step well and now we're going to a little uh, temple ruins that are next to the temple. This is much more. I'll be okay. Yeah, it's trying to cross, sorry, making sure I don't die. But we have to take our feet off in the temple. Zach was asking if I wanted my socks. Be okay I think. But it's hard to take our feet off. Take my feet off, yeah. Alright. See you guys inside. I put a toast of reality into our video. Look at this beautiful bench. And I was like, I want a picture here. Cause there's this like bench here. Zach was like, I, I literally don't know if those are seeds or larvae, honey. So incredible India, totally beautiful. Gotta, gotta be realistic with it.
All right, we had a great lunch, and now I'm gonna try to use the washroom. Ooh, baby chipmunk. Here's 11 and 12. Or here's 12. Maybe they said 10 and 11, I don't really remember. I'm not going over one more. These are like glamping tents. How do I get in here? You. This is right. Am I pulling the right one? I really don't know how to get into the bathroom, you all. Oh, maybe down here. Okay. Ooh. This is like a clamping tent. This is it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yes. platform you'll see there is a river behind it now those but this is just commercial business this is not quality Things. I don't 
room, which smells like, what's it smell like in here, honey? So this is our mini bar area. And this is our room. And it is, it's really lovely too, but in a totally, yeah, in a totally different way than what the other one was. I'm gonna hope to try to get some more footage of the front and everything in a bit. Wax, it smells like wood wax in here. Like it's a really clean wax. All right, bathroom looks pretty much identical to the last, the last one, one we had. Except the showers are getting even bigger. And guys, there's a loofah. Never saved it. Or an oral care. Oh, two oral care. Uh -huh. Never saved saved someplace. Oh, I don't know words. Never been someplace that I got a loofah. Alright. Let's see if we can get a view. Uh Y'all. Oh, 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 I just discovered there's a balcony. What? <sighs> we have. I'm staying in a palace and I have a balcony. I mean, I'm filthy and dirty, but I'm staying in a palace and I have a balcony. <laughs> this is baller. We're gonna do a tour. We're definitely doing a tour because, let's be realistic, this is going to be the nicest place I ever get to stay. So I might as well enjoy it. Sorry about the exuberance there earlier, guys. I just got real excited by this hotel because it's swanky and I feel like a pretty, pretty princess. Um, so I actually uh, booked myself a holistic massage so I'm gonna go get a massage. I'm not gonna take you guys with me because that's, I don't know. I don't wanna keep track of my camera. I can't really bring it into the room with me because I'm gonna be naked. So I'm gonna go get a massage. Um, and then afterwards, Zach and I are gonna go to dinner and probably just call it for the night. So see you guys tomorrow.